What investment advice do you have for young people of my generation? No, if you're interested in financial matters, A, a you've got to have something to work with. I mean, I, I, I was fortunate in that respect because my dad paid for my education. Uh, if he hadn't, I probably wouldn't have become educated if I had to pay for it myself. But, uh, so I was able to save $10,000 by the time I was 21. And, uh, you know, that was a huge, huge head start. Uh, if I hadn't been able to do that, and, you know, my first child came along when I was 22, so I mean, the, the family, it's, it's much easier to save it uh, in those teenage years if you're lucky enough to be in a family where you don't have, where your parents are taking care of your financial obligations. Uh, every dollar then is, you know, worth making 10 or $20 later on. And so if you are interested in financial matters, Getting a stake early uh, is very useful, and getting knowledge early is very useful. So, uh, you know, I would say you're well on well on the way if it, if at 11 you're even interested in coming to a meeting like this. And I would, if that interest is maintained, you know, I would read financial publications. I would I would read whatever was of interest to me. I'd I'd be curious about how the businesses around uh, the town of Kearney operated. I would. Uh, to the extent that you can get people to talk to you, and people usually like to talk, you know, learn about who's got bu good businesses in Kearney and why they're good businesses, and learn about the businesses that went out of business and why they went out of business, and just keep accumulating knowledge. That's one of the beauties of the business that Charlie and I are in, is that everything is cumulative. The stuff I learned when I was 20 is, is useful today, not necessarily the same way and not necessarily every day, but it, it, it's useful. So. You're building a database in your mind that is going to pay off over time. But you have to have a little money to work with. So there's nothing like, there's nothing like getting a few dollars ahead, stay away from credit cards, and uh, you're going to have a lot of fun if your mind goes along that track as you get older.